<laughs> What's up, guys? Hey, we're back with another episode of Max That on the Town Hall 9. That's right. As you can see, we've got a lot of gold. We've got a good amount of elixir. We're getting back up with that dark elixir. Uh, so, yeah, obviously we're going to be upgrading some stuff in this video. Um, I'm not too worried about my air defenses right now. I'm not. I'm just going to say it. I'm not worried about my freaking air defenses, okay? Because I'll get to them, and I don't get attacked by that many air troops. I would rather upgrade my archer towers because they do air defense, and they also do ground defense. So we have <clears throat> one max out archer tower down here. We have one, two, three, four, five more to go. Oh, by the way, new base right here. Um, <clears throat> trying it out, farming base. I spread out my loot all the way. Um, around the base so the most anybody should be able to get is like two of the storages depending on where they attack and if they're good uh, <laughs> it hasn't been attacked by anybody yet um, besides people just taking my town hall which I'm always fine with uh, so yeah but <laughs> um, but anyways <coughs> we are going to go over my new favorite attack strategy Wazarian guys it's gnarly it's so freaking gnarly um let's see here come on let me go into my freaking attack log all right so as you can see look at those look at those three attacks right there just with the wazarian attack strategy 100 percent on the top 72 84 percent and look at the loot that i'm getting with it too so the loot's always really really good and it's not that expensive it really isn't so um yeah definitely try it out i'm going to show you guys how i do it in this video um so y'all can see my strategy of attacking. I think that the first time I showed the Wazarian attack strategy was um, on the Town Hall 8. So we're going to be doing it up here with the big boys, um, with the almost max out wizards. I'll get them eventually, guys. I will. I promise. But anyways, why don't we go ahead and use a whole bunch of this gold and upgrade this little puppy right here. Boom. There's another one, guys. And none of that gold's from gems. That's just from farming with the Wazarian, with the Wazarian strategy. Um... So, yes, I definitely, definitely love that. And something else that we are going to do right now is we are going to, um, as you can see, this Stark Elixir Drill is at four. This one up here is not. It's at three. We're going to upgrade that thing um, as well. What do I have? What? Where is my... There it is, my laboratory. Uh, what am I doing with, with spells in here? Do I want any of those? I could boost the heal spell for when I do all hogs, but um, I'm not really worried about that. I'm honestly not really too worried about that. So I am going to go up here and we are going to upgrade this Dark Elixir Drill to get us a little bit more per hour. There we go. Two upgrades already. Two big upgrades. Big costs. Five million gold. Come on now. Uh, and let's go ahead and go on the attack. And as always, maybe we'll run into a sick base in the first couple. Um, but yeah, guys. So I'm in the new house. I'm loving it. I'm in the new office um, doing big things. I'm really, really excited for the summer. Hang out with you guys a lot. I'm still working on streaming, so I gotta figure that out because apparently, um, here we go. Look at this. <clears throat> That's what I'm talking about. Oh gosh, this is gonna be a great base. This is gonna be a great base. Let's see if we can pull out the king right there. Okay, we can. Does he only have one expo? He does, and it's on the top. Um, so we're going to attack from down here at the bottom. Um, see if I can pull this king all the way out here. Uh, and just wreck him, and then we are going to completely wreck house on this. Let's see if we can take out this uh, wizard tower and uh, mortar and just those two. Neither of them, really. That sucks. <laughs> that was. I'm sorry, that was a terrible deployment of those lightning spells. I should have just taken out the mortar. Um, so both of those are gone now, and he's about to get taken out as well. Let's go ahead, and we're just going to start spreading. Um, we're just going to start spreading our barbarians around the base like this. Yep, and then we're going to drop off our wizards all around the outside, and we can go ahead and drop off a couple of wall breakers to get them in there. You, you really got to make sure to keep your um, your barbarians as the focus so that your wizards can do work and just work their way around. Um, we can bring some more barbarians up here, <coughs> drop off one wall breaker, and then drop off like three wizards up there uh, just to help with that. Um, you can see that they're working their way in right now. We have a whole bunch of our wizards up. Uh, we really need to get in there to that mortar. I, if I if I had done a better job with those lightning spells, 
um, then we would be able to take out that other mortar. It really sucks that we weren't able to. Um, let's go ahead and see if we can get our guys in here. Um, and we should be able to make our way around. <clears throat> this is sucking. That mortar is doing work. That really, really sucks that uh, it happened like that. Let's see if we can get our barbarians up in this um, area and then drop off a couple wizards right there. Um, and then we're going to bring our archer queen up in here as well as some wizards right there. Don't hit that wizard. <laughs> All right, so Archer Queen's going to take out all that gold right there. Um, these uh, barbarians over in this top right area are doing doing pretty good work right now. Uh, the Archer Queen is doing perfectly, perfectly fine. She's not going to be taking that much damage at all because none of these defenses are really that good. Uh, I would really... All right, so she is in range of that expo, so i got to make her invisible real quick. Um, and there she goes taking out that cannon. She took out the rest of that. All the troops are down now. Um... Should I use a lightning spell on something? I don't know. I mean, I have it made, right? <laughs> uh, and we got 53% right there. That the, the reason that that didn't go well was because of that fail lightning spell usage right there. I should have dropped one lightning spell on uh, this mortar right here and one lightning, and then or two lightning spells on that and two on the other one. Um, but instead I got greedy and I wanted to take out that um, other thing. I'm gonna drop right here. And let's see if we get a good amount of stuff from that. Um, eh, no, wasn't that good. <laughs> but whatever, that's still a good amount of loot, guys. 223,000 gold, 195,000 elixir with a really, really cheap army composition. It's not that expensive. Um, I mean, it is, yes, you can do barch, but barch isn't going to get you um, in as far as that does, or at least not from my experience. So, uh, Wazarian, I really, really like. I think that it works really well. Again, the only reason that failed so badly was because of that lightning spell, because that one mortar was just doing work to everybody. Um, so if you guys do this, make sure that you don't make that same mistake. <laughs> so I'm going to train up four of those again, and then I always do one, one, two, three, four, just like that. I work my way all the way to the end. <clears throat> just to, The reason I have the wall breakers is because it just helps them get inside a little bit. Um, and then you do 37 barbarians if, again, you are a town on nine like me. Um, so 37 Barbarians in each one of these, and look at that, that was perfect, and 37, yes, <laughs> two 37s in a row. Uh, so that's the full training for that, obviously if you have a Town Hall 8, Town Hall 7, whatever, you're going to use a different amount, um, but I generally, if you're a Town Hall 7, I might do 12 Wizards or something, but if you're 8 and up, definitely do 16 or more, um, and the Barbarians are going to make a great little wall for your wizards to go and do work. But anyways, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. We are upgrading another <coughs> archer tower as well as another dark elixir drill, which is freaking sweet. Uh, I can't wait to get more dark elixir from that so that we can upgrade um, our archer queen and king. Where are we at? Where, where is my freaking king right now? Where is he? Oh, he's up here. So he's going to be done. He's going to be level 10 in one day. Um, and once he's done, then we're going to have the second level of, of his ability, which is going to be awesome. Um, so, yeah, but that's it. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I really do appreciate it. We're growing a lot. Um, we're probably going to be to 70,000 in, a, I don't know, two weeks or so. So that is going to be great. Um, and one more thing, guys. If you use AppNana, go ahead and um, check out my code for AppNana. It is going to be in this video. Uh yeah, use that. It'll help you guys out. It helps me out. Um, it helps me have gyms and whatnot to continue performing in this game. And hopefully, uh, as you guys use that and I figure out streaming, then we can stream and that'll be great. So thanks for watching, guys. Y'all rock. I really do mean that. Um, and as always, make sure you keep calm and clash on for me, right? See you guys later.